Victorian town by the sea, soiree in the garden, champagne on the shore. One neighbor was not invited, the ocean, but it will even the score. In the lost cities of the deep, amid sunken treasures in the blue abyss, clad in pearls, gold, and ocean foam, sirens live in luscious bliss. When the tide is low and the rocks are bare, waves gently deliver on the sand. The ocean's most dazzling jewels, revenge against the arrogant land. As the foam dies on the twilight sand, the enchantresses rise to dance. They open the wings of cobalt and red, unraveling visions of romance. Some dream of love, some dream of gold, some dream of sailing to distant lands. Sirens lure the dreamers deep to a hungry embrace of currents and sands. Sailors and brides and councilmen, the mayor's daughter and the pastor's son, and the hippie who sells hot dogs on the beach. They never came back, not even one. Why is craving for love a mortal wound? Why is it that dreamers always perish first? The kiss of a siren fills your heart with unquenchable desire, with burning thirst. Some want a mistress, some want a bride, some wish to save a maiden in distress, some want to dance, some want to die, all will fall for a siren's caress. But when the winds whirl up the waves and the tidal billows crash and sweep, the ocean comes to claim its own, taking back what belongs to the deep. Dreams unfledged and hopes deferred, phantoms of love and empty shells, all wrapped in foam and rolled away into destiny's chambers and bottomless wells. <laughs>